The Supreme Court considering a Mississippi law that puts Roe v. Wade on the line. After nearly two hours of arguments on Wednesday, it appears all six conservative justices are leaning toward upholding the state's 2018 law, which bans abortions after 15 weeks. Now, some are questioning whether Roe v. Wade will be overturned, including former Vice President Mike Pence. I came here today to speak about right and wrong, to say life is a human right and urge the Supreme Court of the United States to choose life. If the justices decide to uphold the state law, it would be much easier for other states to ban or more seriously restrict abortion rights. Pro-life ralliers took to the streets of Manhattan to make sure the Supreme Court gives a voice to the voiceless. There is a hearing in the major case Dobbs versus Jackson that brings hope to us. With banners, signs, and chants, the activists aimed to add their own testimony to that being heard in D.C. It was just one of dozens of protests being held across the country amid the Supreme Court abortion case. Praying on the outcome of the case, U.S. bishops are urging all people of goodwill to uphold the dignity of human life, saying in a statement, we pray that the court will do the right thing and allow states to once again limit or prohibit abortion, and in doing so, protect millions of unborn children and their mothers from this painful, life-destroying act.